Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Anil and this is our second video on React with Material UI. In this video, we will see that how we can install and use the Material UI with the React application, right? And for that, I am also creating the fresh React application so that we can just go ahead with step by step and everything from the scratch, right? These are the points of the video. First of all, we need a Node.js and NPM in our in our system if they are not installed then you have to install them and if you are facing some issues to install the node and npm you can ask me in the comment box i will help you out then we will create a new react application and we will install the material ui and after that we will test that is the material ui is installed successfully or not and we will also check some examples so that you can find the difference between a normal ui as well as in the material ui right so first of all let's open the command prompt and check out that our node and uh, npm is installed or not here you can see that node as well as uh, npm both are installed so just go on a desktop and uh, just right here npx create react app and your application name so let's say my application name is react mui mui simply means material ui and hit the enter so now let's wait for a moment to install it react app react application has created now let's go inside it uh, just right here react mui and uh, just right here npm start so that we can just start it and in the another tab you can just open it in the uh, editor also right so now we actually have to install the uh, material ui also so just right here npm install at the rate material UI hyphen UI slash core and just hit the enter and within that time so let's go inside the project and just remove this stuff that we are just looking here so let's go in the app.js and uh, remove this stuff because this is not required for a moment and uh, just simply write here uh, let's say h1 tag and just write here react material ui and something right so we are able to see this text and i hope this is also about to install yep uh, this is done now we have to go uh, on a material UI website and just click on the get started then you will find that the similar command that we just run here and uh, if you are using the yawn then you can just run, uh, run this command after that keep in mind that uh, we have to just use this font and this is a roboto font uh, Material UI is always work with only Roboto fonts only, right? So just uh, copy it from here and let's paste it inside the index.html, right? So just simply paste it here, right? So everything is fine now. So now let's uh, just uh, try to use some, you can say that the Material UI component. So just come to the app.js and just import here import something from and just write here at the rate material ui code right and just find out here button when you use the normal button like this then you just notice that the button start with the small case right but when you use the material ui button you will find that this is start with the capitalized case so just right here normal button 
and uh, here you can just put here like this and just put here MUI button right and uh, you can feel the difference in both of them but in normal case you can see that uh, the material UI button is look like normal text when you just hover it then it will just show some uh, button color otherwise it's looking like normal text right so because there is a lots of variant and lots of button type in material UI so let's grab some another one just go inside the component uh, don't think that why we are jumping directly on button because I just want to show you that how we can use these things uh, after installing right in the upcoming video in the next video I will just starting everything from the scratch this is uh, in this video I just want to show that uh, material UI is installed perfectly right so just get all this button from here and you can just simply paste here and now you can feel that this is all about kind of bootstrap like uh, default button primary button disable and all right and uh, the similarly we can just use the copy and paste like uh, if you are used the normal HTML then uh, we probably copy the code from uh, bootstrap site or somewhere else and similarly we can do the kind of things like here right and these are the button things In the next video we will see that uh, more stuff about the material UI and for that video if you have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel and like this video bye bye take care